Let's see if I can do this big scary mission or not. <laughs> Might as well learn what it is, because I don't actually know yet. Probably should throw a save in there, so I don't have to redo that base management. Where's my manual save? Right here. There we go. Alright, let's give a dangerous mission a shot. What could go wrong? Besides absolutely everything. Alright. At least I have five squad members now, that's, that's something. Alright, I feel like there's a decent chance that two specialists might be much. Though it is double healing. Let's see, sniper. Probably want to equip you with those those uh, venom rounds. Rounds do extra damage and can poison any uh, organic en targets on hit. Doesn't specifically mention how much damage it might do. Bonus. I guess we'll just see. Can I upgrade the sniper rifle at all? I think I've used my upgrades in general. Or do I have to use edit for that? Let's see here. Weapon upgrade, there we go. So you already have increased aim. What are my other options now? Chance of instant kill, laser sight, or crit chance. Improving with even, uh, even further with the proximity of the target. That'd be good, that might be good for a, a shotgun actually. Miss shots deal one damage. They're all decent upgrades. Let's try to apply some of these. Let's see. Visit our shotgun friend here. See what I can give this weapon. Ooh, there's a few. Is there another option here? Increased aim by 5%. Right, we couldn't put a scope on the other weapon, is why it wasn't showing up there. Bonus crit would be nice. Instant kill chance. It's just such a gamble. Missed shot damage is certainly tempting just to be able to guarantee at least some kind of damage on some characters. Having someone with that equipped means that I could help guarantee do it, dealing d the last piece of damage. I think I'm going to go for the stock. It can be replaced but not reused. Yeah. I like the idea of having the uh, missed shots do damage because that means when I get to the relatively common situation of having a character sit around with one hit point left, I can specifically rely on a specific character to finish that off really quick before we get in trouble. There we go. I think Darren will be good to go. I don't know if I want two... Uh, probably don't want two specialists. I'm probably going to take out Plagid or Wanderbot. Let's go ahead and bring in our, our other... Uh, oh wait, he, they might not be available yet. They, uh, yep, our other ranger is still gravely wounded. So my option is another Grenadier. That might not be a crazy option, being able to blow the shit out of people when given the chance. Yeah, I, may t I think I'm going to go for that. Extra grenades in the field. Let's see, Specialist has their med kit equipped. Good. Let's look into weapon upgrades. Advanced Repeater for in instant kill chance is tempting. I think I might give him the instant kill chance. If there's any time to start applying weapon upgrades, it's right before this mission, I think. So these three are all upgraded, these two aren't. Out of these two, you're most likely to be shooting more. Just prioritize you next. You could probably use an extra hit chance because you're a lower, lower level character anyway. There we go. And you've got the crit, I think I'm going to say. There we go. I'm just throwing everything out there for this run, I think. Alright, so we have a med kit and venom rounds. One of the close range characters has armor. One of them has natural armor from their spec. One of them is a new character. 
that could just might just die for all we know. We'll see how that goes. And we believe we're fully equipped. The reward's going to be 125 supplies. Difficulty is ranked as difficult. I saved. Let's see. We don't have any currency with which to build items. And we don't have armor to switch through anyway. I think it's time to just go. Wish me luck, everybody. Is it time to break our winning spree? <laughs> Ranger deployed. In position to drop. Our contacts in the local resistance have shown us how to access the Advent Black Site. The aliens worked hard to keep this place under the radar, and we don't know what we're going to find in there. Keep your heads up. Expect heavy opposition. the black site is in your immediate vicinity. Infiltrate and investigate the area. Expect heavy resistance. Neutralize all hostile contacts. No time limit? How was that? Is that my extract? Wow, that's far away. Alright, good news is no time limit, so I can at least be cautious, but looks like a chaotic map. So that's my target, and then that's my extract. Thankfully nearby, but I'm not- I wouldn't be surprised if there's enemies waiting at the extract, too. Just to cause me some more problems. Let's see. We have a five-person crew. A decent objective will probably be to try to make our way under the roof for line of sight and potential sniping opportunities. Being so close to a ladder certainly helps. Let's pick one of our assault characters. Sorry, um... Rangers is what they're called now. We keep that straight and just see if we can line of sight anything. For the love of God, don't fucking spot me at the beginning of the very first round. Alright. Could be bad guys up here, but I don't have much reason to go there unless I complete the objective and everyone's like, You gotta kill everybody! Shit, you didn't kill everybody. Go back now. That'll be frustrating. Go ahead, forward, Klaus. Oh, cool. Building interior. That looks safe and pleasant. Uh, dare I approach window? Let's press everyone forward a little bit more. On the move. That's the limit of his movement speed. Hey, newbie, check out that window. Newbie's dead now. Who knows oh. how long they've been keeping these storage units running down here. All right, not so bad so far. I want to just hop straight on that ceiling, but I'm worried about line of sight for obvious reasons. Uh, how far could I make it up here? Can't even make it behind cover c properly. That's extra worrying. Let's go to the base of the stairs and, and plan on ascending next turn. That'll at least give me an opportunity. Alright, specialist. Let's go ahead and follow him up. I feel like going up there is my best chance of getting an advantage in this area because there's walking down the middle of a central alleyway with potentially multiple large buildings around. Yeah, there's another one. Seems like it's just going to open me up to fire. Alright, this wall's going to be ours. <laughs> this is my wall, no one else gets to have it. Moving. There we go. Dear Lord Tsunami Shadow is in chat. 
There's a surprise. When you see some when you see someone show up from like long before you ever started doing videos online. I can make it that far. Dear lord. Please don't get spotted by someone. Are we are we alone up here? Oh thank god. Cool. I can work with this. Alright, Carl. I'm on the move. This seems like one of the better approaches we can make right now. All of it's half cover around here, right? Yeah. Logic would tell me that uh, being high up would give you bonus cover somehow, but I don't know if that's actually the case in this game. Either way, we only have two turns of bonus movement, so using them to get up, up on top of a building where I can scout around a little better is going to be nice. Mother fucker! This is our first time seeing that? Um, what's our chances here? Four to six. Oh yeah. Oh, it's two armor. All right. Between two characters, we could wait. We could wipe it out. Let's see. Can I hack it? Where's my hacker? There you are. Can you do a thing over there? I don't see a hack option. I doubt we're out of range. Are you out of line of sight or something? You do have the inability to shoot it because that, that, that one chunk of wall has counts as a full wall, basically. Huh. Yeah, that is, a, that is full cover right there. Which is a bit of a surprise. Oh, bummer. If I take you there, you're gonna lose your line- you're gonna lose movement. And you're gonna- you're gonna be worse because you're further away. Oh, you can barely get upstairs. Maybe if I get the other guy out of the way first, you'll be able to move a little further. Alright, Jirodyne. This is probably the best I- oh, that's probably decent. Heading to that location. I just don't want to be down here anymore. A lot of people have died on the dirt. Hey you, Darren. Slightly better movement, but not really. Let's get up here. So the question of course is, do I want to attack this thing right now, or do I want to see if I can get around without breaking line of sight? Uh, I should just take it out. I'm, go I'm trying to go this way, and crossing this top of this building and trying to go down here. Unless I make unless I make it several turns without breaking stealth, that thing's gonna shoot me while I'm trying to go around, because it, it sh it's perched perfectly to have a lot of range. So I think I want to take this thing out. Let's go visit... Jirodyne. See what kind of frag we can launch here. That should be well. That should do well, just fine. Is that going to be enough for me? Let's give this a, sh a shot. Come on. Um, I blew up the building over there, so I think I got the turret. Yeah, it did sh one shredded, one armor. And then the whole corner of the building got blown off. I think I got him. That is fantastic. Because fuck turrets. Wow. That's just satisfying, frankly. <laughs> I hate architecture. End it all. Dare I press forward? I feel like I'm gonna see something bad on the way in. Let's probably just stop right here instead of making it all the way to the edge of the building. Let's see, Darren. You can press forward to here. Roger that. Still taking it slow because no one's actually shooting us yet. Kraus. Klaus. That'll be Moving. decent cover from that direction. <laughs> that ain't... The, the path he walked was just fascinating, wasn't it? You're the last one that can move, right, because the other guy shot already. Oh, right. My target is right up... That's surprisingly close now. Or at least it feels surprisingly close. By comparison. Don't think I need to send the specialist up right now. Let's hang out for a turn. Alright, so that was our bonus- that was the end of our bonus movement. Oh wait, did I buy the bonus movement yet? I might have not bought the bonus movement yet in the first place. Oh well, doesn't matter. But that was our second turn. No actual line of sight on enemies yet. Let's move forward with, uh... Klaus. Kraus. Because he's relatively durable. Move into position. He's got that nice bonus to armor. 
no one in line of sight. Can they be... Oh, they could be hiding under the building, couldn't they? Nah! They could be hiding right here, technically, but not a whole lot of it anywhere else. Alright. Let's get our sniper in position. To, to cover the party as we continue. Understood. Moving he's, he's probably going to lag behind a little bit, just because this is a nice spot to help people as they mo go across the clearing. Let's see, this is... No, not Carl. Let's go to... Our ranger. He should probably descend first. He can make it that far in one turn, alright. And then this far if he sprints, that's bonus cover right there. Let's go down that far. Alright, bad guys? We can see bad guys? Oh, that's the sound of bad guys. Oh, hello. Um... Bad news is three enemies. Good news is, uh, no stun douchebags, whatever they're called. Stun lancers, so they can't run up and capture me. They can just shoot me a lot, which is also not great for my insides, but only one character's turn is over right now, so a lot of people can still go. Granted, it's a pistol. Varied success there. But three to four damage. Oh yeah, I can do lightning hands to potentially end one of these guys right now. One down. That's good. That is good. The good things are happening, see? If I'm real lucky, I'll take them both out before they get an action. But 55 is significantly lower chance. Did, uh, did I check your hit chance back here? 50. Yeah, it's not, not any better. Unless I want to fire a grenade, but I don't think I want to waste another one quite yet. You're so far back, Jirodyne. Let's see. Move Wanderbot up behind the other piece of cover. See if he gets any better of a hit chance. 89% because of the flanking. Goodbye. I hope. That is a crit. Those are nice numbers that I like to see. Alright. The other guy should be frustrated. Ooh, promotion earned for Wanderbot. Cool. Let's see. Hey, yeah, we can't even see him from here, can we? Let's just go ahead and go into Overwatch. So that if he tries to kill our other player, we'll be wait we'll be ready for him. Technically this guy can go to Overwatch, but it seems a little pointless. Should I press forward? I'm gonna press forward with this character. Heading there now. So that he can help out down there next turn. Alright, so far so good. Oh fuck me. That's what I get for sta standing slightly to the right. Is I can cover completely different enemies. Fuck. Well, it's a good thing I established Overwatch. Hey! He's poisoned. And he's a douchey sectoid, so... Oh, tell me we get to kill him. Oh. Not quite. It would be so nice to kill a sectoid before they do something, but he's gonna do something now. At least he's poisoned. Nice little extra particle of damage. Okay, what are you gonna do? Game is thinking right now, apparently. At least there's still no stun there's still no stun lancers, right? Oh, is he resurrecting somebody? What did he do? Oh, yep, there's a resurrection. Frankly, I'll take that over mind control. At least I can control my characters. Killing a three hit point character again shouldn't be that bad. Oh, it's such a bummer this just happened. Ah. Fairly low damage as far as a crit goes, I guess. But oh yeah, he does have the he has he has armor on. Oh, extra enemy. Things have gotten worse, a bit. Hey, come on, man. Man, this game turns fast. Okay, so almost dead character. Probably want to move you, but I do have either character. Let's see how much... No, not aid. Uh, medic heal. Medic hit heal. Does this character not have that up... Oh! This character is less experienced than my other drone character, so he doesn't have that ability. Okay. Noteworthy. Well, this character is very di dying right now. <laughs> 
So, they can use one action to move over here into medical range. Let's do that. That's affirmative. Need to get him out of here, and then I'll use the after I when I do the heal, I'll move this, use the next action to get out of line of sight, so he just flat out can't get shot. Hopefully, medikit heal. Significant improvement to health, hopefully. And then I'll have him go hop behind something. Alright, where is it? Him? Hello, Darren. Get the hell away from the edge of this wall. You're, you're gonna go live over there for a while, alright? Let everyone else fight for it now. Alright, so. Psy Zombie. Not likely to kill. 46 damage and all that. Yeah. Ooh. You know what? These characters these characters look close together. They are close together. Can I grenade them at the same time? Killing them both? I believe I can. Get ready for a surprise. Fuck you guys. I love you grenades. Okay. More alive than I was. Oh no, one yeah, one of them's more alive than I was hoping. But isn't he still poisoned? So he should take he should take a point of damage at the beginning of his turn and die, right? That's what happened a moment ago. So I don't think I have to worry about him anymore? Let's see who's left. 88% chance of hitting. But these guys are actually going to be alive next turn, so I should focus on them, I think. 3 to 5 damage. Oh, we can't see the leader guy. Alright, I'll work on this guy. Oh, that was unlikely. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking right now. Who's left here? We've got Kraus, we've got Top Notch. <laughs> I forget what his actual name is sometimes, that it's Ed Balls, because the fucking... <laughs> it just has such a, a caps lock. Ooh. Subtitle there, 100% chance of not probably not killing him, but shooting him. 63% chance of killing the officer. We should take the zombie out. Though. Wait, zombie will go down when he goes down, though, won't he? Either way, he can't reach us, can he? I feel like I need to work on the officer. If I'm correct in my brain, which I hope I am, I think that the sectoid's gonna die of poison at the beginning of his turn, and that means that the zombie's going to die at the beginning of that turn because he's only being kept alive by the scion by the sectoid in the first place, so I believe I should be working specifically on the officer. I hope. And I missed. Alright. I love when all that thinking leads to nothing. You know, the chances of the number of misses I've had at this turn. Unlikely. Can I just frag him? Because that won't miss. Oh. No, I can't. I cannot. Do I even have a good chance of hitting him? 89. I can't even hit him from here, huh? Alright. Let's go ahead and overwatch, then. See if someone comes after us. So I assume he... Yep, he's dead. And then Psy Zombie collapses. Yes, I was perfectly correct about something. Is that guy gonna run over here and trigger my overwatch? Come on. No, he's just gonna run over there. Oh, come on. Yeah, I, I guess it's too far away to trigger overwatch for the, for a, a cannon. Still frustrating. 33% <laughs> uh, chance is garbage. And now Top Notch is injured. Great. 67% chance of maybe killing him. I'm afraid to I'm afraid to send someone down there. Do I care about these supplies or do I just blow them up? Because I feel like I could just blow them up and it wouldn't really matter. Anyway, this guy's too far away. So I think it doesn't help to stay down there anymore. Over here is some good proper cover. Can I get all the way across? No, I can't cross within one turn. Kind of want to see what I can if I can make this count or not. Let's see. Let's get behind cover. I believe this is proper cover. Yes. Moving the designated coordinates. All right. Not a good hit chance. Let's give the sniper a shot before I make any other decisions. Firing sniper rifle. 67%. Come on, lucky. Right? 
Right. Right. Cool. All known Target targets disabled. are currently deceased. And promotion earned. Cool. He's probably like a captain or something now, right? I don't I don't know. I don't remember how many how many, how many factions. I mean, uh, how many upgrades there are. So there's the expo there's the ex extract. There's our objective. We're close. This is like the parking lot of the building basically. We just need to make our way across this road. Let's see how well I can fare at that. Let's see. Take our healthiest characters to move forward first. I think, that, I think that's a reasonable choice. Or should I just focus on reloading? How's ammo doing? You know, a few characters could do a reload, and we've already used our first actions for a lot of characters. So let's let that happen for the moment. Rock and roll. You could use a reload. And if I don't move forward, we, we're we unlikely go. to discover new enemies, which means we're unlikely to be attacked. But just in case, put you in Overwatch, along with you. To we'll plan on moving forward next. Let's pop forward with you real on quick. Alright, I don't think anyone's going to show up right now, but I just wanted to make sure our characters were loaded up. Those are walking noises somewhere over here. They're around. I know they are. Alright. Let's go to Girodyne. And just push forward a little bit. Is that full cover? No, that's also half cover. It's a thicker part of the wall, so I was curious if it would work any better. Only that counts as full cover, and it's really far away. That's full cover, but it's outside of my movement range, frustratingly enough. If I go down here, it's a ch decent chance of scouting without... without totally vulner making myself vulnerable. Let's see what I can discover from here. No new bad guys yet. We're inching our way forward, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna work on bringing most of the people that aren't, uh... Work on bringing more f people forward, basically. Let's, see, let's go forward with our... with Kraus next. Probably stop right here. Already I'm assuming bad guys are inside the building, so I'm gonna use on. cover in that direction. Uh oh. The, the containers, the trains, this entire facility. The aliens are still abducting people. From the looks of it, they may never have stopped after the invasion. Those containers look like they have self contained power cells. It could be some kind of stasis system. It's possible at least some of those people might still be alive. Oh, they're just kidnapping people. Oh, that's not too bad. I was worried that, like, it was... They're like, hold on, hold on now, those? I thought we were gonna have, like, a new monster or something. I'm like, no, not right now. This is a bad time for new things. I'm just trying to keep some people alive, man. But yeah, just more, uh, bad guys. I mean, more just bad guys doing bad things stuff is... That's fine. Let's inch forward. I'm on the move. With our more background-type character. Oh, he just jumped straight down. He's like, fuck that ladder. That's an equally valid option. I'm just gonna jump. They can- they must have some crazy portal shoes or something. Those weird claw feet things that make it really hard for you to kill. So if you take cover behind these things, you're getting a human in a pod shot. That's pretty funny. But morbid, but kind of- kind of funny. Trying to go inside here. Is there an entrance portal over here? It looks like a doorway. I think I'm starting to just barely get the beginning of a doorway view over there. Let's go take cover here with my... Ranger. Maybe time to move forward with my sniper. I think we're gonna I think we're gonna be exiting his range soon. But because I, I'm holding off right now just because I'm exhausting everyone else's movement, so I don't wanna also jump forward with him. Good copy, moving on target. Oh. Let's see, dare I pause for one more turn? Or do I just charge forward? Let's go for it. Take cover over here. No need to ask twice. He also likes to jump off buildings. Cause fuck gravity. I got those weird hook shoes from Portal. That means I'm in that makes me immune to gravity. Ooh, I'm hearing footsteps. That makes me worry a little bit. Somewhere around there, there's something that wants to, to pull my spine out, Mortal Kombat style. And I'm just hoping that I see it first. 
Alright. You're my low health assault character. Let's go with Kraus first. That's full cover, but only in one direction. Let's start by going up here. I'm on the move. This should give me line of sight of something bad, I'm sure. Game, you can't do that to me. Stop loading dramatic scenes where I think something that's gonna like like a fucking Hulk character is gonna jump out and ruin all my plans. When it's just, oh yeah, look a building. Ha ha ha. That's a building. That's their whole. That's that's all they wanted to show me is that there was a building, as if I didn't know already. Okay. Dare I shove myself even forward? Let's see. Right now I'm playing as yeah, Jirodine. Let's push him forward. Affirmative. Kraus can cover him for now, hopefully. Ooh, that's a bad sound. What direction is the bad sound in? Not the best direction. There's better directions. Bad booty. Alright. Oh, they have too many hit points. Oh, does that guy... Oh, he's a stun knife douchebag. Stun lancer. Oh, there's two of them? Those are like the three things I don't want to see. <laughs> So we have two stun lancers and we have a sectoid all in one group, and they're hiding behind human bodies, but that's we'll ignore that for now, for the sake of sanity. Can I shoot them? Can I shoot them? Slightly less practical than I would hope. Um Lightning Hands probability? 30, that is garbage. From this I probably should just work on the stun lancer from here. See if I get lucky with lightning hands. Three to four. Hey! That's a radar. Chat, chat mentioned that the buildings often have turrets on them, so I just wanted to take a quick look over there. Oops, accidentally tapped away from that character. Where was my sniper again? There's a sniper. I think I'm gonna take a shot on that alien. It's like a 50%- Oh, I never reloaded my sniper! I specifically stopped to reload everybody. I mean, it, how did I miss that? All right, well, maybe I'll get really lucky right now, right? Right? I did not get lucky. That's not what happened. Well, at least you shot somebody. Yeah, I didn't get it. You re really? All right, cool. Darren, no one's in stabby range. Oh, they're frustratingly close to me. Oh no, and I can't get over there, huh? That's the furthest I can make in a movement turn. I can go here, basically. Or there, but then they, I won't be able to shoot them from down there, right? Bad line of sight. So I think that's the best spot I can move to with Darren. Oh, right. This seems like the part where things start going really bad for me. Inevitably. Hey, friends. That's a shitty chance of hitting a sectoid. 49%. They're probably gonna charge me, right? They're, they're douchey lancer assholes. So I should probably go into uh, over watch with some of these guys. Let's see, grenade. Ooh. Fuck you guys, man. You deserve all of this. I don't even care if those humans inside those pods. For the greater good. Yeah, there's one more. That's one down. This poor guy, though, is just bait. Oh, promotion earned. Didn't he already earn a promotion this mission? All right, specialist is way far back. And unlikely to be able to do much from back here. I'm thinking come up to the full cover spot over here, or maybe half in both directions. Probably want to get ready to do a aid protocol. Yeah. Let's do aid protocol on our more vulnerable character over here. Jirodyne. Get over there, robot. Save the day. I, I'm going to do this prep for Jirodyne, and they're going to charge over after my sniper instead. Just watch it. Confirmed. Let's push forward. Advent has expanded their rail network to touch every city center they've built. And this looks like the end of the line, at least for this area. So my hit chance is garbage. Actually, 59. Ah... 59. I'm tempted to go into overwatch mode to shoot that guy as he runs towards me, but it might be good to just try to take my shot. 
there's, there's a decent chance of obliterating. Ooh, 50% crit chance, too. Yeah. I'm most likely to, to succeed, but it's iffy. There we go. No one's getting mind controlled today. No one's having psi no zombies, but we have one asshole with a stun, gu uh, stun rod that's going to try to knock out my character that I went out front. Ah... Uh, Oh, here it comes. Whoa! Oh, you son of a bitch. He made it way further than I thought he would, by the way. No, don't fucking... Uh, asshole. Oh, is he gonna kill the bad guy at least? Please don't shoot my teammates. I can't even tell what you shot just now, but I really hope it wasn't my teammates. Wow, he was quick to panic. One quick stun rod, and he is out. I guess I defended the wrong guy. I am going to be continually surprised by just how long range those guys can run. Pistol shot, 84% chance is pretty decent. You could also go in for the melee, though. Get a little revenge. Can I? There we go. I want to stand over there and melee him. Can I not do that? Is it too out of the way? There we go. Just had to get a different angle. Because fuck this guy, man. Hey, buddy. Sword. Sweet, sweet revenge. Good riddance. So you're alive, right? You're just unconscious? Can I do something about that with my specialist? That's like his job, right? Is to fix problems like this? Stabilize, stop, yeah, stop him from bleeding out. And medical. How do I get him back up? Do I click on him? It does have like a window. Oh, right, you can carry people, huh? He's probably the person to do that. Here, you reload your rifle. I think we're just gonna have to carry that guy to revive him. I mean, to get him out of here. Yeah, that's probably the a thing for a specialist to do. Let's just not get shot for a turn here, all right? What? Did I click on you? Why? How do I make him... How do I... Pick him up? I... What the fuck? Am I doing something wrong? Whatever. I'll figure it out next turn, I guess. I don't... It had the weird wibbly-wobbly lines, so I assumed I was doing it right. There must be a menu option I'm missing. His panic's removed. Go figure, I killed a sectoid and they still panic. Okay, you. There we go, carry unit. My bad. It had the weird wibbly-wobbly lines around it, like like when you melee somebody, so I thought I thought I could just uh, right-click on him, and so I made that mistake twice, I think. All right. How's ammo doing on everybody? Okay-ish? Press forward. Yeah, we can take cover at least. This mission's do it going way better than I was worried it would. But uh, the part where they don't wake up is frustrating. His peak pants are ass up right now. So that's my goal, the inside of this facility. Which is extra intimidating. Let's go inside the building. What can go wrong? Cool, I was hoping I'd go inside. Let's see. Spend a whole turn running in. Maybe not quite charge forward all the way right now. I can take my time so we can just inch forward and reload a bit. It's a reasonable way to spend the time before we potentially have to use all of, all, all of Rymo on the way in. You... Probably gonna stop down here. Position confirmed. So no one's under attack at the moment. Do a quick reload. There we go. I'm ready. Can this guy? Sh this guy can't shoot anymore. I assume, right? Until he puts the body down. Ready to go. Everyone's reloaded at the moment. Let's just pop a little further in, and the next turn we'll we'll start running towards the door. Let's see if anyone can Overwatch. I'll do that. Nope. All right. No more bad guys, no more bad guys? Cool. I'm hearing footsteps. 
I don't know if the footsteps actually indicate anything or if it's just a thing that happens. What is this thing? Hang on, where was it? Is that just a light? There's a light and a radar as far as I can tell. Ooh, can I shoot at them through the window? That seems like it'd be a distinct advantage if I could. Good Let's go. make our way over here. Darren? Rolling out. We're all gonna group up on this wall again. Oh, guy carrying body can't even probably can't even go upstairs, right? Yeah, you'll have to stay down down here. That's workable. Location confirmed. <laughs> the robot goes ahead so much faster. <laughs> this poor guy's back. Let's go ahead and stop right here. Anyone coming our way? There's definitely footsteps. All right. Hey, sniper. I believe in you, question mark? Is that also a, that's also a radar dish. Okay. Is that cover? That seems like it'd be, re it'd be full cover. Moving. Come on! Ooh, what am I spotting? So many victims. Processed with such brutal efficiency. Test subjects for some sort of weapon, perhaps. Looks more like a refinery to me, Doctor. Once we get our hands on that sample, we'll know for sure. So we have to go get that sample. Extremely well equipped mechanized combat unit. We'll need to look for vulnerabilities if we're going to take that thing out. Fuck. Well, there's a thing to stumble into. He's not going to be pleased to see me. Let's see. <laughs> two to three damage. Minus two. So zero to one damage. That's not good. Definitely more of a grenade them everywhere type of situation, huh? Except I can't even grenade them from here through the, the, the glass, can I? Let's see, if I shoot down there, do I obliterate the sample? Oh wait, the sample's way back here. Okay, the sample's totally free of danger. A nicely timed grenade could be really helpful here. Jirodyne? How far can you make it in one move? Action. Not great. What if I take a step back and just see what happens next? Let's see. I think I want to get on the roof, but I don't want to, uh... To I think I want to break their line of sight. I think I'm, I think I'm gonna pull the sniper back, actually. Actually, uh, sniper... Lightning hands means I don't have to actually stay here. 62% chance. Let's take that 62. Might be able to take one of them out right now. D I did that. Alright, cool. Enemy eliminated. And now, I think I want to back the hell up. Before I get in trouble here. Let's see. This guy's right down there, so he can probably run up here. Let's go take cover. Ah, uh, ha ha! Let's go back here. Hopefully I don't spot someone new. Not yet, alright. I'm hoping that being in that position means I'm not gonna get attacked right now. Let's see, you're carrying a body still. So I'm gonna wanna get over beat to cover. I can't carry this guy around up, up, stay up the ladder, so I want to get behind cover. Might even drop the body here, actually. Them down. This should be a safe place to leave him. Darren? What do I do with you? They might come storming through this door. I'm wondering if I should specifically leave shotgun guy here for that purpose. Let's shift right here, and overwatch. overwatch. We'll see if they head my way or not. I'm, on it. I'm hoping that I'm out of line of sight and they have to move to do something. Oh, fuck me. Right. 
I'm learning things about this guy I didn't want to learn. <laughs> no way. One damage for missing. He's down to two hit points, but he, he might... Oh! Did that use... Please tell me that was his whole turn. What? How does that line of sight work? Oh, counter shot. Not quite, but that would have been amazing. Okay, now he's dying. So that's good. Everyone's dying. That's what I was hoping would happen. That return fire skill is so badass, though. Well, this guy became my new neighbor. So that's terrifying. Hey. Hey, you guys. You can't do much else from out down there. How about you help out? Three to five damage, you say? Well, that guy's down. Kill confirmed. Wow. My, I, I perfectly set up my party to obliterate that mech. Kind of on accident. I was just like, well, anyone who hasn't moved yet, let's overwatch in case anything chases us. I figured they might, something might come through the door or something. Did not know he could jump like five stories high. But thankfully he wasted his turn and did no damage to me. The damage that came at me was actually unexpected, which is that guy shooting through the window? Is that how this worked? Yeah, I think that the game counts this as line of sight, where he could shoot through this narrow window and hit me. Meaning that these are just the most impossibly accurate aliens in the history of anything, which I'm pretty all-around impressed by. Let's see. But I'm gonna want to get the sniper the fuck away from everything for a moment. Actually, unless I have a really good hit chance. Which I do. Fuck him. That's the last guy, right? Bam. And then his head was everything. All over the place. Forever. Did we win? Did we win? Steal vile, escape with vile, extract all soldiers. So none of them would indicate how many enemies are left, unfortunately. I'm gonna have to, uh... Settle for opening a door. Rolling. Wow, how lucky that I happened to put down that soldier and just be ready for that situation. <laughs> Wow! I just did so many things n not entirely intentional that perfectly countered what was about to happen to me. Alright, anything down here? I really hope there's no one else in here. If there is, why weren't they part of that fight? <laughs> That's another question to have, right? These guys down here are gonna have to go through the long way. Let's see. Jirodyne. Jiro oh, Jirodyne's the only person I can control right now? All right, the guy shot already, so that means he doesn't have any actions. Confirmed. All right, buddy, I'll cover you from up here. All right. Oh man, no one has died today yet. You know, yet I gotta add that, but still, so much better than than the last pl session where I recorded three episodes where everybody died every time, basically, <laughs> or almost everyone. I am salvageable. All right, let's carry this unit. We're not leaving you behind, Hot Pants. Gotcha. We're just very now. slowly keeping up with you. <laughs> Carl's the savior bot here in this one. Yeah, those things don't seem to set off any sort of alarm, do they? They just kind of exist. Keep pressing forward. If I'm lucky, there won't be any more enemies in this facility. If I'm unlucky, uh, someone's going to die. <laughs> I'm particularly worried about the sniper, for obvious reasons. One hit point left and no way to... Oh no, that's the sound! Oh, and there's laser doors. Ple oh. At least there's no mech this time. That's at least something, right? Oh, I feel like I have to just move this sniper somewhere where he's out of all line of sight, right? I feel like no one can shoot him right here. I hope. Pistol Overwatch. I really don't want anyone else to die. There's a genuine risk here. All right. It would certainly help if someone wasn't stunned right now. They're very far away down there. Do I want to move further down? I could hop down there, but then there's no one here with a sniper, and I feel like we need someone with him too. But if I don't move down there, how do we shoot these guys in the face? <laughs> Let's see, I need to get in the proper grenade position. Do I have a grenade left? Oh, that, right, that's Jirodyne. He doesn't have grenades. The guy with all the grenades is unconscious. God damn it. Alright, let's just press forward and go into Overwatch. 
see if they'll come to me. Oh, come on. He can use psionic powers from that far back? Oh, you son of a bitch. No, don't do stupid. Don't do stupid. Don't do stupid. Oh, Darren, you're doing a stupid. Did you even take cover correctly? You heard the doctor. Secure that canister. Shut up, Central. People are losing their minds. There's more important things going on. Oh, you are so fucked. Damn it. Oh, everything's so much worse. Okay. I was not ready for that. I was not ready for any of what just happened, really. We're gonna have to drop the body. Do I still get to do anything this turn? After I do that? Got some fragile cargo here. I can fire a weapon. That is a garbage chance of success right there. And it's a stun lancer, which is also not good. Everything's kind of bad right now. Oh, and he's probably gonna run after me too. And you don't have any grenades, so I can't use you for that purpose. And we're totally out of line of sight to even help right now. How, where can I get to in one turn? I can get down here. That'd be two turns. Oh, that's this one turn and it's behind cover. That's my best chance right now. We're gonna jump. Hopefully no one else is in Overwatch right now. Oh man. Everything's a clusterfuck. 34% is such garbage. I, I need to work on it, right? I need to do something about this. Come on. Come on. Nope. That's not what's happening today. Man. I'm running low on ammo. And I'm in a situation where if I move, I'm going to be in trouble. I can either attack or move, not both. And I can't kill him with this character, so I basically have to move. And he's probably going to knock people out. It's going to be hard to, to retrieve people. I think the best I can do is try to take proper cover. Moving on target location. Mm, everything's bad. And this guy's almost dead, so I don't want to do him, use him for anything, really. But I kind of have to. Because if I don't use him, everyone else... Yeah, er, everyone needs to be shooting right now. If not everyone is shooting, we're likely to just die, right? Affirmative. Moving out. So I need, I need to use him. Except, oh, but he can't, he doesn't have line of sight? I really thought he'd have line of sight from down here. Guess not. Well, that means they can't shoot him yet. He'll go into Overwatch and maybe he'll get a lucky for line of sight as they approach. If they do. Oh, there's another one. There's four of them? Is that a second sectoid? No, that's the first sectoid. There's a, there's three troopers. Overwatch. Yes. Be a dead guy. Cool, he got poisoned. All right, he's half dead. Stop. No, no, no. Oh, ah. Oh. Ah. These guys. All right, his panic's gone at least. Uh, but he's he's so close to an enemy right now. Jesus. Alright, can you shoot him from here? Sniper, sniper rifle? 67% chance. Take it. Yes. We got one less problem to deal with. And since I couldn't target anyone else, and I'm in a super specific location, it's unlikely anyone will be able to shoot back at that guy. Is Whoa, Girodyne's alive. Is he? I'm controlling Giro right now. Oh, then this guy's fucked. Fuck you. Welcome to Earth. Oh, that's satisfying. Look at him falling over into the dumb vat. Air trigger. This, this is so goddamn tense. It's all the same feelings I get from Darkest Dungeon. Playing these two games back to back is really stressful. You're, you guys are gonna give me a heart attack. I hope you guys are so happy about that. Sectoid right there. Where's the other guy? There's another guy, right? He's oh, he's behind this building over here. So that's something to worry about. So it's tempting to go run out there and, st and stab that dude. Which would do some damage. Potentially all of the health. But there's someone else covering him, I believe. And that would kill you. And I don't want you to be a dead person, as it turns out. 
I know it's a shock, but it's really helpful if you're alive. Can I get full cover anywhere? That's a partly broken wall. This is actually full cover right here, huh? Let's go a little further over here, though, to full, better full cover. And just overwatch. Try to cover our own. We'll do aid protocol on our more damaged character over there. Try to avoid the attack that comes our way. I have enough characters covering one area that I'm hoping enough overwatches will defend them. I am so happy Jirodyne didn't actually go down. That would have been really bad for me. Come here, motherfucker. Come in that window, I dare you. What are you doing? Is... Is... What? He can attack through that hole, but running up to that hole didn't trigger anyone's overwatch? That is a zombie. Well, that's gonna trigger some overwatches. Right? Really? Oh, there we go, yeah. No? No. No one shot the zombie. No one thought that was worth paying attention to? Okay. Interesting perspective you got there. All right, I can fire on you. 100% chance of obliteration. Four to six damage, not a, not complete obliteration. But I don't want to run in line of sight of the sectoid who could totally shoot me. So I will just work on this guy. Can, can no one shoot that sectoid from here? L oh, lighting hands. Ooh, hello, sectoid. I will just do- I will give everything I can to shoot the sectoid, because everyone can shoot the zombie. There we go. God... Damn. Ball's just so goddamn useful, isn't he? <laughs> don't miss, don't miss, don't miss. Got him, sectoid down. He has one hit point, and he's somehow still making himself useful on the top corner of the map. Oh yeah, and he, oh, he just died right. I should have started with that, I guess. No more enemies in line of sight, that's something. Huh. <sighs> How many bad guys can be left? So that's the extract point. And that's the canister. So someone needs to grab the canister. You have two hit points, you have three hit points, you have a lot more, but you're unconscious, goddammit. You're full on health. And this guy... As one. Man. Alright, Carl. I think it's time to go grab our friend again. Uh, should I just have people reload for a moment? Let's reload. I think I'm gonna have the sniper come down, because... We're quickly gonna get in trouble with a line of sight. Or he won't be able to cover people, or if he, or even worse, if he encounters somebody, no one will be able to cover him. Let's just overwatch while we wait. Let you reload now before you pick up the body. Locked and loaded. No one's coming our way at the moment. Reload. Let's do this. And reload because sniper rifle. Ready to See, how do I hop down here? Not the best cover. Oh, there we go. Okay. That'll be a decent cover. Die, window! God, they're good at jumping ridiculous distances without dying. Alright. Now is where careful happens. Everyone ready for careful? Let's pick up the body. Not this guy- this <laughs> Everyone's just having a bad day today. I'm gonna have, I think I'm gonna have to take a break after this mission just to relax. Just to not take a little break from XCOM after this. It's just too many stressful encounters back to back. Oh yeah, we've already used one of our first actions. Oh no, we haven't. You, you, you can't shoot because you have no one in line of sight. Alright, inch forward. Roger that. Gonna be careful here. It's really funny watching them just run over stuff in a, instead of around. Alright, press forward go, with the go, with go. the body. Go. 
Uh, how many more bad guys can there be? <laughs> I, I anticipate one more wave between this and the extract point. I don't know how I'm going to deal with that. Man. Those laser bars, you can't use those. Can't, I think I'm going to go around this way. It'll give me a nice line of sight to some extent. I think that's, that's probably the best approach I can take. We'll see how it goes. Yeah, you've already done your one action. You can come down here. That's decent. Orders confirmed. On the move. It's some progress towards our objective. Ah, uh, no bad guys yet. It's probably going to come down to shotgun guy to grab the uh, relic. Let's see. Let's go down here. I'm all over it. So I think you can't go out the laser bar doors cuz they didn't I, they didn't come through it, did they? They ran they ran around here through this door or shot through this wall. So that must just be something you can shoot through. So that means that the, the, basically this or something like that is my way through. So yeah, I think I'm gonna come out here just because we've already established that direction more or less. Zerodyne. Understood. Moving out. Keep it casual. Everyone cover each, cover each other all the time. You stay put for now. Don't exactly want you charging ahead. I want to be cautious with how far forward we take our sniper. I'm all over it. One hit point for so long in this run. This is really worrying to me. Yeah, is that the last person for this turn? Let's stop. No bad guy yet. All right, let's, let's take the vial. Are we going to get instantly ambushed? Please, no. Black side vial. Loot recovery. Got it. Guessing that's not water in there. Shen, any readings? No signs of radioactivity, no significant energy signatures of any kind. Whatever it is, it's safe to handle. We've confirmed acquisition of the sample. Move to rendezvous at the extraction point. Looks like they called in some friends. Fuck me. Oh, right over there. Just not the news I want to hear, because that's my extract point over there. There's trees over here, right? That's some things I could use as cover. I think I do want to go around that way. I think that just sounds generally safer to me. Let's get up to this door. No new line of sight bad guys. Here, Jirodyne. Come out to this pillar. No new bad guys, no new bad guys. Sweet. That is all the good news. It's inch to this corner now. And we're going to be fighting around this corner, more or less. We'll see how that goes. Let's see, this will be cover. Oh yeah, you can run a little bit. Let's go here. Copy that. That'll be an alternate behind cover location where I can potentially shoot at people as they're coming around the corner. I'm just praying I don't hear combat music. Yay! Top notch. Similarly gonna take proper Moving cover. Yeah, <laughs> that hole in the wall. Your last one. Pistol overwatch. Come get some. Starting to get a headache, so I just went ahead and took a little bit for something for that. <laughs> oh, the stress of not even knowing where they are right now. Okay. We need line of sight. What's rough is my ideal solution would probably be to put Sniper on top of ceiling for line of sight. But Sniper dies in one hit, so that's a less appealing option than usual. Thankfully there's no guns on the ceiling, at least. Your Jiro. Can we establish line of sight on the bad guys here? None, huh? They're over there somewhere. 
Uh, stressing out here. Let's see, do I want to go on the roof? Understood. Let's go over here for now. There's no full cover options. Everyone's solo on health, and I'm just fucking worried here. It's right there. And there's somewhere around here. We're probably gonna wanna just drop you for now, right? Maybe I can get closer first. But we're probably gonna be fighting here. Gonna be coming this way. Let's see. Orders confirmed. On the move. Still no line of sight. Really can't make it very far in one action. That's affirmative. Oops. Got it covered. Let's see if they come my way. We still have an action for Darren. Who can't do shit from back here. I'll do Overwatch, not because there's a particular reason that I'm likely to oh, actually activate Overwatch, because I don't want to move him out into the open right now. Where are we na right now? Wait, did I not just click on that? I must have missed or something. Oh, they ain't, they're not coming my way. Okay. Son of a bitch. Oh, cool. Yeah, shake my head from chat. Th thanks for the most condescending acronym in the f in the history of text communication. It's really good advice to just say shake my head and, and offer nothing. Alright, we have cover. There we are. We have line of sight. It gives me something to work with. Not the best hit chances, huh? Alright. This is where it'd be really good to have a sniper shot. I mean, a, a grenade again. They're very far away units. Are any of them... Hang on a second. I don't see blades on their backs. Nope, they're just gonna shoot me a lot. At least it's straightforward in the way that I'm gonna die today. I think I have to risk it, so let's get out into the open. Heading to that location. Uh, if they approach, I'll, I'll do a pistol overwatch just because it's the best I can do from here. Do what we can with the cover we have. Try to coordinate so we reduce the number of incoming attacks. Do I have the ability to do... yeah, aid protocol. Let's use aid protocol on our, on our injured character. Just try to avoid the death. Here we go. These three guys, and then we probably are done, right? Just gotta hope for the best. I'm on it. Yeah, we can't even connect a shot from here. I probably should just back the fuck off right now. And lure them to me. Probably the best I can do. Up on top of this roof or something. Or around the corner. And just be bait. I can't get around this corner properly. I can go around here, that's about it. You know what? Yeah, let's lure them to me. See what I can do with that. It would have been better to use the aid on the ranger at that point, obviously, but I'm, I'm trying to... I had the realization a little late of how I could get them to come my way. Uh-oh. Oh, thank god. They're, wait they're spinning a turn on marking. Except they're, except they're probably gonna execute on that now, so that's not good. Uh-huh. Hoo-hoo-hoo! I'm pinned down here! Okay, we're alive. Where's the last one? Tell me he's out of line of sight or something, that'd be great. Oh my Fuck! God. Fuck me. Alright, we lost someone. We 
We've lost control of the sample. Recover it at all costs. We have to find out what the aliens are doing here. I'm genuinely shocked that's our first death at this point. Uh. Not the best hit chances here. Chat, why would I use hunker down? What's the point? Just to increase my defense so they keep shooting at me, and then they, then they keep shooting at me, and then they keep shooting at me? Like, what's the point? That seems kind of pointless to just sit there and get shot at over and over again. Because that's as far as I know, you can't hunker down and then also attack people. And they're going to just kill me if I don't do something about it. Let's see, lightning hands is free. Holy shit, that actually worked. Haha! <laughs> Okay, let's see what we can do here. So you're the one that has a 29% chance, which is just garbage. What else can I do with this party? We can at least inch forward to take, get an open shot. We're down to three characters. Chat says they gotta reload, don't they? I've actually never- I don't think I've ever seen evidence of the aliens reloading in an XCOM game. I don't think I have any reason to think that's the case, actually. I really wish I had a grenade. Ah! I'm so bummed out that the guy that used all his grenades is the one that didn't get knocked out, and the guy that had all his grenades got knocked out. This guy's closer. Let's go for that. Actually, no. This guy can only- the, only, the other character can only target one, though, right? Oh, sniper. Duh. 41. You can only target one character. Alright. Focus on characters who can only target one enemy right now. No luck this time. Not even close. Alright, you, I think, are also restricted to one enemy. No, you're not, but... Oh, the hit chances are garbage. Hit chances are garbage. This is really worrying. <laughs> I feel like I just gotta go for the closest one. Come on. Ah. No such luck right now. If I can at least just take it down to one guy. Come on. Come on. Yes, the collective dice rolls eventually worked out. Enemies down. Between three characters, someone has to land the, land the shot. Alright. One guy. Please miss. For the love of God, miss. Yes! Fire over here. Wanderbot continues to have no damage on his character. <laughs> With all the shit that's happening to everyone else. He's probably really snipable right now. Come on. Ah. <sighs> no more combat music. Target down. Oh, it's a mistake to film this much darkest dungeon and XCOM back to back. It just stresses you out. <laughs> oh, is that the last one? All right, so we grabbed the relic already, right? We have the vial. Let's have Wanderbot go back to grabbing the body. The can at least get him out of here. Honestly, with how big of a mission this is, I can. Ex I think I can accept one casualty. Especially considering how the, the, the three missions went last session. Uh, do I even want to press forward right now? Let's just reload for a moment. Before we press forward. Man, getting a harsh lesson in why to bring more okay. medkits around. So that sniper has like 20 kills now, right? That's what's going on. Multiple hostiles advancing on our position. Oh shit, they're just gonna keep coming. Are you serious? Does a new wave come every goddamn turn? What the fuck? Ah! Fuck! This game does not 
slowly introduce you to mechanics, does it? <laughs> it just blindsides you with 50,000 rules while hitting you- while giving you a crew of characters that die in two hits. It is not- this is a, this- it really is a save scummy type of game, isn't it? Like, how do you do this without knowing all these Warning secrets in advance? Location. They sure as hell don't fucking tell you. God damn it. At this point, do I want to just hop on back up top or something? As I approach? As the sniper? Seems like the best I can do with that character. Let's get up there. Fuck. I didn't know they could just keep coming back. I thought it was just a wave. Ah. Uh, fuck. I feel completely doomed at the moment. I, just, I gotta push forward, obviously, if they're gonna keep respawning in the same spot that's right next to my destination. I just gotta keep pushing forward so that I can fire on them the moment they spawn and then hopefully hide and just book it for the exit. Otherwise, we're screwed. I get at least one turn of grace before they come down, don't I? They can't just- they can't just storm me- storm me immediately. That's affirmative. Fuck. Let me guess, they're worse now or something? Is- is it three mechs? Oh, they're fucking stun lancers. Fuck me. <sighs> I can call a plane and book it. But I thought that- What's the- If I can just extract, what's the point of this? I can just extract anywhere? Is that what you're saying? Call Sky Ranger. Ability unavailable. Alright, chat has no fucking clue what they're talking about, as, u as usual. Uh. Motherfucker! It's just a wave of assholes! It's just every asshole that ever existed. Shit. 85, 85. I really wish I had that free shot right now. There's their officer. I gotta take, take advantage of the 85, right? Here, let's see who the... What my chances are with this guy real quick. 64... Come on. Ah! I, this is fucking mind-blowing to me. How... How is that a fair thing to do in a mission design? Just endless waves of enemies right next to your extract point? And they show up like a turn later? What the fuck? It's really brutal when you don't know what's gonna happen, which there- how would you know without playing in advance and then reloading your save? God damn it. 49... 29... Uh, I gotta go for who I can go for. Oh shit. Aid protocol on our sniper because it was one hit point. Ha 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 ha! Eighty five, eighty five. Gotta really hope for a kill here. He's got six hit points, I do five to seven. Come on, man. Come on, just give me one kill. Huh. <sighs> There's gonna be so many goddamn promotions for the for the one guy that survives this. I haven't reloaded. Oh, I'm out of ammo. That's a fun problem. I've gotten weirdly good at pausing for a reload turn and then not actually reloading during that turn, apparently. Oh, fucking stun guys. Stop! No. This looks a little ugly. So he's down. Oh, and there goes my reinforcements. Oh, I just got back up. I thought I took four damage. Oh, right, I had more hit points than that. Huh. 
Misa mad at you. So what's going on here? Surprise. Target eliminated. Oh. <sighs> Running dry on ammo. Yeah, yeah. I get it. Come on, lightning hands. See, if I'm just gonna do pistol shots, I may as well get closer, right? So I could flank him. That's the last space spot that's cover. On my way. So first action run over here. Fuck, he's an overwatch! Ooh. Okay, we're alive. We're alive! I thought he marked me. How is he an overwatch? Shit, he did all oh, right, he didn't move, so he had those those were his two actions. Fuck. Go down, go down, go down. Come on, pistol shot. Fire pistol. And hit. Smite that motherfucker. Fill him with the gigawatts. <laughs> I swear to god, they're... Alright, so reloading is not gonna be a thing that happens right now. We're just gonna try to run for it, basically. Alright, you have a full turn. So I'll try to get over here. On my way. Uh, carry the unit. And we are just gonna run for it, is what's happening here. All right. That was a yeah, weird I'll moment run. for me. Good copy. Fuck, there, there better not be more enemies. There better just, if there's a, like, I'm, ch I'm running away from the next reinforcement phase, and I j I'm just booking it across dry, dry land. If there's another, if there's just surprise enemies standing around, I'm totally boned. Moving to position. Ha 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 the edge of my movement radius. Ha ha ha! I just want to. Get, I just want everyone else to live. Come on, man! I just, that's all I want. On the move. Just give me that. Been through so much. This mission's so long. It's draining all of my my spirit. Uh, who, someone who's closer go first. Just so I can still. What the? Oh wait, that's your whole turn. All right, uh, stagger the move. Moving to designated coordinates. Fuck this. No one knew. Oh, for the love of God, just don't have an enemy right there. Don't do this to me. <laughs> just let the map be empty except for the maybe reinforcements that are probably coming. I just, I need that. I need that in my life. <laughs> One of you has the thing, right? I think he picked up the vial when the other guy died. Rolling. Uh. Did I just miss? I just clicked past it, didn't I? Oh, no, I didn't. Evac. I'm out of here. Get those two out of here. Ah, so satisfying. So satisfying to see them get away. Are there no more reinforcements? Oh, wait, I paused to reload. So maybe there's one more turn before the reinforcements? Oh, that was such a shitty surprise. I was so unhappy about that. <laughs> Nothing but infinite salt. Evac, get out of here. Getting out of here. Balls is safe. Congratulations, the balls are safe. Last person is Wanderbot. Uh, he's like one tile away from making it, so naturally there's gonna be like a nuclear warhead that wipes him out just to spite me. <laughs> uh, I don't see that signal. It might, there might be actually no tension. There might be there might be nothing actually endangering me at this point. <laughs> For all I know. Oh man, my head hurts right now. <laughs> all surviving XCOM operatives are secure. Firebrand returning to base. That's too many consecutive stressful decisions. <laughs> we just hit Advent where it hurts. This is a place no living human being was ever intended to see. <laughs> There's 29. As I am to see it gone. There's 23 kills. Something tells me the aliens won't take this lying down. Fucking 23 kills. <laughs> ah. Fuck me. All right, we're stopping for the, we're going to be stopping XCOM for the night. It's not necessarily old streaming, but I'm going to
I'm definitely stopping this game for the night. <laughs> and taking a break. I should eat something, frankly. Huh. Ugh, sorry about the casualty. Who died? Darren? Was it Darren? Gotta keep the name straight in my head. I think it was Darren. I think Darren was the only ranger in this run. So Darren's double dead. <laughs> he died last time and this time. But that's way better than how many people died last time, which was every single named character. <laughs> and then one that I named that day. Oh. I can't believe the sniper lasted that long with one hit point and still made it out. Even after the that really shitty... Uh, everyone promoted. <laughs> oh, Balls has 23 kills. I think he had 12 when that mission started. And <laughs> he got 11 more. <laughs> Fuck. Alright, let's promote people. Alright, next rank. So last time was Lightning Hands. Let's see, Quick Draw. Firing your pistol with your first action no longer ends your turn. Ooh, so you could fire and then move. So you could do light. You could you could fire your pistol and do lightning hands and then still move, which is pretty great. Death from above. Killing an enemy at a lower elevation with your sniper rifle costs only a single action and does not end your turn. Oh shit. Costs only a single action. Does that imply you could shoot again, or does it just mean that you could uh, just that you can move afterwards? Let's see. Huh. Here, chat, if you chat, if you've used either of those abilities, let me know if either of them lets me shoot twice. I'm gonna just look at other characters for a moment. <laughs> uh Grenadier Demolition, unleash a volley of bullets at your target's cover, significant uh, significantly damaging or destroying it, deals no damage to your target. Could really vulner make them vulnerable to the sniper or something though. Uh, suppression. Fires a barrage that pins down a target, granting reaction fire against it if it moves, and, and imposing a minus 50% penalty to the target's aim. Ooh. That's just really nice. The idea of making it so that someone's almost in way more unlikely to actually shoot somebody. Oh, those are both really promising. Those are both very promising. I think I like the, the idea of suppression to try to control an individual enemy to stop them from running around and attacking people. Using suppression on like a, uh... I like the idea of using suppression on a stun character, for, exa for example. That sounds like it'd be useful. Here we go. Alright, Jirodyne, you survived. Congratulations. <laughs> uh... I feel like the blast padding is how we survived that mission. I think I just want to give them more armor. For the love of God, keep our characters alive, huh? My poor, poor characters. Ah, uh, specialist. There's medical protocol. I need the extra healing so bad. I've missed it ever since before. Yes, absolutely. Extra healing. All of the healing. So much healing need needed. Let's see. Chat is recommending death from above. Seems like it would be handy because it lets you it lets you still control your character after shooting. And high altitudes, how I've been using this character this whole time. Versus dead eye, take a single shot, a small aim penalty for significant. Yeah, I don't I don't like the idea of that I don't have enough accuracy for that. Quickter almost feels slightly superfluous. Let's go for death from above. Everyone upgraded? Cool. Now that we've recovered the apparent product of the Black Site facility, I imagine it will take considerable time and resources to uncover the true purpose of this substance. I will begin preparations for a complete analysis immediately, Commander. All right, we have the Black Site vial. And a few other upgrades. Hair trigger is when firing soldier has a five percent chance, the shot will not cost an action for the active turn. Interesting. 
All right, and now, naturally, the moment I pick one act skill, Chad immediately recommends the other one. Would have been nice if they said that when I initially asked for advice, but they took their time, I guess. Oh, well. I'm ready to move on with my life, because this mission destroyed me. Alien encryption. Unlike the conventional encryption methods we would typically encounter with terrestrial data stores, the aliens appear to be using an advanced matrix consisting of both mechanical and biological ciphers, combining with some form of psionic interference. The thought of uncovering the Allies' most complex designs is both intriguing and frightening in equal measure. Having now seen the inner workings of the Black Site facility, the outcome is perhaps even more troubling than I had expected. It is clear the aliens have undertaken a gruesome task. I will leave this matter for you to investigate, Commander. God damn it, now everyone in chat saying to do quick, quick, quick draw. I gave you guys several minutes to say that, and none of you said anything. All right, I'm just gonna move on. New objective <laughs> added. Ah, we got it. Complete the alien encryption research. We're getting thin on manpower, Commander. We should check with Resistance HQ for new recruits. The aliens are relaying a form of encryption beyond anything we've ever encountered, much less theorized. We'll have to find a means of breaking the code. But I expect it will take some time. Oh, we don't have enough to do a full squad. Oh, it's because everyone's injured. <laughs> it's because everyone is injured. Damn. Although in five... We, we've never had another fight in five days, have we, before? So two people will be back in five days. A, a sharpshooter and a, and a grenadier to match with a specialist and a rookie and a rookie. That's a little rough. That is a little rough. Either way, I'm going to take a break, guys. Thanks for watching like always. I will see you next time.